Dune is ultimately a coming-of-age movie, where our main character is transitioning between childhood and adulthood. Hi, my name is Piotr and this is Dune Explained. So, what's interesting about this movie is that maturity is symbolized by a character that's not even in the film. It's the deceased grandfather. He's an ideal to which Paul and his father aspire. So, maturity is defined in Dune as being fearless and grandfather fought bulls for sport, yes! and being a capable leader. This is the end goal of Paul's character change. If he doesn't achieve it, it's a tragedy. If he does achieve it, it's a comedy. <laughs> it's a joke from another movie. Can you tell which one? Let me know in the comments below. Anyway, back to Dune. If Paul becomes a fearless leader, it's an obvious happy ending. Therefore, in the first act, we meet him as a sensitive young man who is troubled by his dreams about the girl on a desert planet. He sees his visions as something that he should be ashamed of because mental instability is not a character trait of a leader. More dreams? Then the Herald comes. I stand before you as Herald of the Change. Since his family was elected to rule the planet that our hero is dreaming about, he will have to go on a journey to help his father govern this new land. In the second act, there will be trails. The failed ones? Remove her gag. The successful ones? And ultimately, in the third act, Paul is going to prove himself as a warrior by taking a man's life in a duel, which is arguably more impressive than bullfighting. He's also going to prove himself as a leader. My road leads into the desert. I can see it. Now, the death of a father figure is a very important theme in coming-of-age stories. Screenwriters know that to put more pressure on the protagonist, you need the father figure dead as soon as your character is ready to take his place. There are different coming-of-age films that utilize father's death to raise the stakes. The King is one, just to give you an example. And by the way, not every coming-of-age movie has to star Timothy Chalamet. I mean, it's not necessary, but it is welcome since he's a, such a great actor. Another interesting thing about Dune is that it's a plot-driven film, which means that an exterior events provoke the change in the character. If you want to learn to write movies like that, you can watch my free course on the matter. The link is in the description below. Thank you so much for watching.